One question I get asked a lot, particularly in the class settings or if I've posted a video of my training, um, top question is always what treats am I using? So although there are specific treats that I always do recommend in training settings so that we can have their attention, have their focus, the main thing is not the actual treat, um, it's how rewarding it is to your dog. So it's different for every single dog so i can't say there's one treat that works for every single dog in most cases but it's whatever is most valued by your dog some high value examples include things like cheese little cubes of cheese and um, some cooked chicken and um, some sausage that's suitable for your dog one thing i use a lot of that is super high value to a lot of the dogs that I come across, whether that's in the situations of puppy classes, the private one-to-one -one sessions, um, particularly in cases of where we've got sort of more nervous dogs or reactive dogs, is sprats. Um, now, if you don't know what sprats are, they are just dried fish. <laughs> Bit ugly. Uh, very stinky. Very high value. Um, to a lot of the dogs that I see. Another really good tip is that whatever treats you use, you need to make sure that they're really small. So I've got a German Shepherd and I still use extremely small pieces of treat and she will still work for me. Now the reason for this is so that at the end of the session, we've only used maybe two or three actual treats, but we've cut them really small. So the smaller we cut those treats, the more that we can use in one session and our dogs aren't going to get fat. So a good example of this is the pet munchies packets. These are what I like to use in the class settings. All the pups get these when they come to me. And if you can see, they're very, very tiny little pieces inside. They are perfect size for nearly every single dog I see. That's the size that we're aiming for if you're making your own treats as well. So... Find out what works for your dog. Find out what your dog values the most. Is it sprats? Is it cubes of cheese? And make sure that you have them cut into small pieces so that we can use lots of them over one session. A good example is, and um, here's, here's Ivy, wanting one. 